just finished working out and I'm completely drenched. Um, I'm so sore still, but I pulled through. So, hello. I also got a ding from my camera system in the front door that my mango order is in. So excited for this. However, I should probably hide it from William. But I need to go take a shower first. I have a super cute like date night um activity planned for us. Well, nothing out of like the normal or anything like that, but it's a new restaurant that we're going to that I think is um opening weekend this today or this weekend so shout out to my cousin that actually um reached out if i wanted to take her reservations um so yeah we are going into the city so i need to shower um and get ready so let me take you through that and i actually need <laughs> to go to the nail salon so maybe i'll go this weekend don't know yet The first item I got was this like little halter top situation. It's a like a linen material as well. I think it's so cute. Um, I don't really remember the pricing, but I got it in a medium. Um, it's really cute. Hopefully it fits. If not, some of this stuff will probably have to get returned. Then the next thing I got is just like a satin um, top I think can work um, for like summer and winter maybe. Um, material's really nice. It's extra small. It looks a bit small for me, but um, let's see how it fits. Then the next thing... The third thing I purchased, which I'm really excited about, I really do hope they fit. I got them in a size, I think six and a half, but European size, it's 37. It's these really cool sneakers that um, are like a creamy um, color, almost like linen. Well, they're not linen, but they're like linen color, I would say. Um, and they have like this like fringe detail um, and like the rubber sole. I'm really excited to try them on. So they fit a little tight in the front. Um, however, I'm wondering if they'll like stretch since they're cloth. So I'm trying on both um, at the same time and they fit fine i think i'm gonna end up keeping them um they won't be like walking shoes or anything like that but they're still cute then really the whole entire reason why i even did this order was because i've been wanting a coat and i bought it for their um they were having a sale and it was like buy four items and get 20% off on top of like the 50 um, or I think up to 50%. But this one was a really great deal. It was, if I remember correctly online, uh, it was like $200 um, and I got it for 79 So I really want to like see how it feels um and fits Ooh, hair. but I don't know the material feels a little off so I don't know if I'm going to keep it actually it's supposed to be like an oversized um feel as well so let's see how it looks so because I'm short it fits all the way down um however I really do like how it Fits. Like I said, it's supposed to be um, like an oversized fit for it. 
Um, however, the arms, I think, seem a little bit too long, but I think I can always like hem them up or I don't know, take them, take them up. So the materials are 53% wool, 37% polyester, blah, blah, blah. And then I think the lining is 100% polyester. Um, but I mean, all in all, I think I am going to end up keeping it. I needed a black one anyway, so I'm, I think I'm going to keep it. sitting out and it was golden hour so I can pop up some photos in my video right here but we are going to another vibey um speakeasy that I'm taking William to for his first time the feeling in my system feels right cause I came here to dance 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 Bigger vehicle. 
So, uh, let's see. Yesterday night, we did like a little like date night, William and I. We went to this new restaurant. It's called Sophie. Um, it is so cute. The vibe is very like French um, inspired, like the south of France almost in the exterior. And then they have like an interior area. Um, and it's very, very like speakeasy, like very... I don't know I just like I loved it um I think I'll like pop some little like clips in here in this um vlog for you guys to see but if you're in the Houston area you must go and check this new place out it's in the Montrose area um so you know a good like happening area I guess not that I would know because I don't live in the city anymore um and then after that we went to this other place called Clarkwood they have the best um express martinis that i have had um they have like a roasted marshmallow on top of it and it is literally so good um so that was william's first time there i've been a few times and he really enjoyed it um however though like at night whenever we came home like i feel like i couldn't fall asleep because of the express martinis so I don't know, I guess like don't drink express martinis so freaking late. I am going to eat really quick um, and continue my shopping. I actually ended up purchasing the table, they had it in store, um, and it was a lot cheaper than what I thought it was going to be, so I'm winning today. <laughs> I picked up um, Chick-fil-A and if you guys didn't know this trick so I ended up getting the um, kids meal it's a five grilled piece like nugget I got the mac and cheese substitute for fries and instead, um, if you don't want like a toy, which obviously like I don't, you get to um, pick up a scoop of ice cream, which I think is so awesome. However, I didn't think this through because I'm in the car and I'm not gonna go home. So I might just have to eat my ice cream first before it melts. Okay, now we're gonna head to Home Goods and see if I find this like witch hat that I saw last time and I'm actually like kicking myself that I didn't pick it up um and it is so freaking cute for like Halloween as like a centerpiece um like maybe you could just put like candles around it and stuff like that so I'm gonna see if I find it hopefully I do but I don't know I don't have much hope